Diamonds in the rough, I watch sometimes with amazement as each year Bachram arrive to learn at Levar Yeshiva here in Veyakov. The remarkable progress made by the Bachram during that time in Eretz Yisrael is testimony to the dedication and the devotion of all of the staff. Just as it takes hundreds of tons of ore to be mined and processed in order to produce a single one carat diamond, the Rosh Yeshiva and Rebbeim put an immense amount of energy into each bachar. Well, Levari is about taking young Yeshiva bachar and turning them into young men, Bnei Torah, giving them a way of life. Come out of here, you're, you're, uh, you grow up more, whether it be in learning or in, in uh, personality. You, you're a better person, you're a better friend, you're better, you learn to deal with people. Bain, they're, they're great. I mean, uh, they know how to relate to the Bachman very well. Focuses the strengths that would have been applied to other things that weren't so great and applies them to good things. When you take a step back and you look at yourself and see where you were before the year started and as the year is ending and you see the leaps and bounds that you took, although you only took it step, tiny step by tiny step, you realize that they were right when they said you can. And really, you can. I think there are a lot of <clears throat> Talmidim who go through elementary school, go through high school, even Bes Medrash, they have koichas, they have innately within them um, sides to their personality and strengths to their personality which for some reason don't come out. And Malayvaria has this special siyata lishmaya of being able to actualize those inner strengths that lie inside the Talmud. There is some sort of esoteric pressure that happens here, which allows the Talmud to bring out the the real, true strengths that he has, and once they actualize themselves, then they continue. I think when Chazal say that Avir de Yisrael Machim, uh, I always have this feeling that it doesn't mean that when you get off the plane in Ben Gurion Airport, you suddenly become cleverer than you were before, or more intelligent than you were before. There is some type of special Siyata de Shmaya which exists because of Kedushas Eretz Yisrael, which doesn't, which doesn't exist outside of Eretz Yisrael. And therefore, <coughs> we're playing a winning game, because we have on our side the, the Kedusha of Eretz Yisrael and the Avir of Eretz Yisrael, which is Machkim. says that obviously, according to the Chachomim, the Kfais wants to suggest that the din of Nidret Stoker is, I am mechuyev to give to an Oni. I obligate myself to give to an Oni. But the fact that he... The Rebani Shalem said to Adam Arishan that Bashas take a look at all my different kinds of uh, trees. Each tree has its own milus. Each tree has its special way of pruning it. Adam, ki Adam eitzasode. Man is compared to the trees. In every, in every yeshiva, in every community, there are different types of trees, different types of human beings. Yeshiva's Levaria, its motto is Ten Dat Choshle to Kalkil Lomi. Each tree has to be pruned, each tree has to be watered, each tree has to be looked after in a different way for what that tree needs. Ha Adam eats Hasode. Nobody is the same. Nobody will ever be the same, nobody thinks the same, nobody behaves the same. Each person has its own milas, each person has his own kishreinus. The main motto, which is the common denominator from all trees, that all trees need water. Avedas Hashem, that is the water that is needed for every tree to go. Then, separately, each tree has its own kaychas, which we try to our utmost to fulfill at the best of the bocha himself, Koichas. Americans, English, Canadians, we all go come together for one reason, or to build and grow in certain areas. The fact that, that uh, you can have a mashkiach, a Gervalopian, who will stay up until 2 o'clock in the morning just dealing with the Bacha is a really amazing thing I don't think you have in most other yeshivas. Yeshiva which can take upon any guy, work with what they have, and push them forward. Come to the base managers, the dining room, the diras, that everybody, all the bachrim work together, are here together for one reason, just to grow. And you see how everybody helps each other. There's no, there's no politics, no cliques. Everybody's one big family. 
Everybody here in, for the purpose of learning and everybody encourages everybody else to learn. It's not just, you know, how do I get the most fun out of life, it's how do I gain the most out of life. I think if I want to sum up the success of Leivari in a few sentences, I'd say like this. There's a lot of different types of Bachar who come in. And Leivari gives each the environment that each Bachar can grow at his own level. And with the guidance of the Rebbeim, he grows in his Ruchnius, he reaches his potential. And whenever he's ready to tune in to three Siddharma day of learning, the, the environment's there ready for him. It's, everyone's growing on their own. There's, it's an individual self-motivation. If you don't have the self-motivation, the Rebbeim helps you develop motivation. The Yeshiva's provided in this environment and it's worked. And the Bachman, after a year, two years, tune in and grow at their potential. Yeah, he's a, 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 he's a